Hello students, we are going to start our new chapter, chapter 9, HCF, Highest Common Factor. In this chapter, we are going to learn how to find HCF of 2 or 3 numbers. We are learning 3 methods to find HCF. The first method is by finding the factors. And the second method is prime factorization method. And the third method is division method. What is HCF? HCF is the highest number using which we can divide the given numbers. If two numbers are given and which is the high, biggest divisor of those numbers. That will be the HCF. Let's see the first question. First we are going to do, we will find the HCF by finding factors. How can we find the HCF by finding factors? Let's see question number A. 12 and 16. Two numbers are given here. 12 and 16. We have to find the HCF of 12 and 16 by finding factors. Now, factors of 12. Which are the factors of 12? You can see here, 1 twelve are 12, 2 6 are 12, 3 4 are 12. Now which are the factors of 12? 1, 2, 3, 4, 6 and 12. These are the factors of 12. Next we are going to find the factors of 16. 1 16s are 16, 2 8s are 16, any more? Yes, 4 4s are 16, 1, 2, 4, then again 4 is repeating, 8, 16, these are the factors of 16, 1, 2, 4, 8 and 16 are the factors of 16. Now next what we have to do, we have to find out which are the common factors of 12 and 16. You can see here 1 is common for both, 2 is also common for both, 4, any more common factors can you see here? No, then which are the common factors? One, two, and four. Now, what is the HCF of these two numbers? Among the factors, which is the highest one? That is the HCF. Here, four is the highest factor. That's why four is the HCF of twelve and sixteen. You can divide twelve with four without leaving a remainder and we can divide 16 also with 4 without leaving a remainder. Means this is the common factor, highest common factor for 12 and 16. Understood children? Now let's do one more question with 3 numbers. First we have to find the factors of 16, then we have to find the factors of 24, then we have to find the factors of 36. Factors of 16. We have already found out here. We can see that and write. 1, 2, 4, 8 and 16. Now, which are the factors of 24? We can find out. 1, 24s are 24. 2, 12s are 24. 3, 8s are 24. 4, 6 are 24. Is there any more? 1, 2, 3, 4 is here. And 6 onwards is there. Means we have written all the factors of 24. We can write 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, 8, 12 and 24. 
Now next we are going to find out the factors of 36. We can see 136 are 36. 2, 18 is 36, 3, 12 is 36, is it coming in four table? Yes, 4, 9 is 36, okay, we can write here, 4, 9 is 36, 6, 6 is 36, we can write down the factors of 36, 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, 9, 12, 18 and 36. These are the factors of 36. <coughs> now we have to find out the common factors of all the three numbers. You can see 16 has got the minimum factors. You can match with that. 1 is a common factor for all. 2, 2, 2. Yes, 2 is also a common factor. 4, 4, 4. 4 is also a common factor. 8, 8. But here there is no 8, so we cannot make it as a common factor. 16 is also not a common factor. So common factors are... One, two, and four. Now, which is the highest among these common factors? That is four. So our XCF is equal to four. The highest common factor is the XCF. So we can divide 16, 24, and 36 with four without leaving a remainder. Means 4 is taking the place of divisor for all the three numbers. All the three numbers are divisible by this 4. Hope you all understood how to find the fact find the XCF by finding the factors. Thank you, children.